Hello everyone, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. This is the Longland map. Yeah, uh, it is. Definitely, it's the Longland map. Yeah, you said that. Right, yes, I did. Okay, so we're looking here at our finances, right? So it looks like we're doing somewhere around uh, 10 million or so per accounting period. And that's, uh, that's kind of good, right? Um, yeah, that is kind of good. Uh, we're doing 10 to 15 million, so we got plenty of cash coming in. So we don't need to worry too much about that. Now we're in 1872, so we don't have the really cool uh, high capacity vehicle operations yet. So we're not going to be uh, doing fancy truck operations yet. But I do have, however, a plan for the next little bit here. Yeah, I do. So I'm going to, uh, now, now here, uh, I'm going to run uh, the food processing here. Now we've got four food processing plants here. Yep. And those um, will each run uh, four, I think, uh, farms. Uh, so, so from here, 16 farms, right? So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven there. Yep. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and change here, right? So we could run some, uh, uh, crops there into, um, the food processing plants, right? So what I want to check here, now we've got this mountain here and we've got this one lone food processing plant over here. And then we've got these three here, which, uh, which can uh, operate uh, separately uh, or together or something. So what I want to do, I want to check to see if I can uh, get all of these in range of one station. So if we put a 320 meter station here, yeah, I'm not sure we can. No, we're going to need to, first of all, uh, install a road. Um, we should probably install one of these roads. No, not that way. Yeah, like that. Uh-huh. And this can come like this. Yeah. Okay, so I'm doing this, and then can we get a uh, tendril along? We can get tendrils along there. Um, right, so if we do this, now, can we get one train station to cover all of these? Well, no, we can get two in. Uh, we can get two in with a... Hmm. I might be able to make that work without these. Using these... Um, using this scheme... Uh, so, if we were to take a cargo platform and, hmm, or maybe I want to do a sort of shunting operation here. Maybe. How would I do that? Well, 
Well, the first thing I'm going to do is uh, just try building a long uh, station here. Yeah. No, first of all, I'm going to build a road off of this one. No. Uh, like this. Yep. And then we're going to uh, do this. Right? Yeah, we're going to do this. Okay, so we're going to need as many platforms as we can stack in here, I think. Hmm. Now, if we were to stack this in right about here, what if we did it right about here? Yeah, we can do it right about there. Uh, we get a massive uh, train station there, right? And then we can grab, I don't know, this can come in like this. Now, okay, that gets those two. Yep. Now, here... Okay, I can't put on that side a, okay. What happens if I lengthen this by the two that we can, okay? Um... What if we put a cargo building here? Can we? No. Uh, we can put one here. Yeah, that wouldn't do any good. Hmm. No. Uh, tracks. No, we do this and this. And we do our platform here. Then we do a cargo building here. Wait, what? No, we can go further. We can't go further there. But we can with... Oh! So I could do this. Okay, now if I did that, would I be able to get a road up from there? No, 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 no. Okay, we can get a road up like that. Ah, that gets all three. Okay, right. Let's try something else. Cargo buildings. Put one down here. Uh, right here. Now, can we uh, do the road thing from down here? Uh, if we did that, and did this. Yes, we can make it work from... Okay. So we configure this, and we get rid of that. Yeah. Then we can do this. Right, platforms, cargo, uh, like this. Yeah, okay. So, 
we can then uh, do something here, which, uh, yeah, can we just do this? Yeah, we can. Okay. And, yeah. Okay, so that gets all of those in range of that station. Good. Uh, that we can we can live with. We can work with this. Now, uh, the question then is, what do we call this? Um, right. This will be the Dog River uh, Food Exchange. Uh, the food exchange. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be the food exchange. Oh, okay. Right. I think probably at some point this would work better as one of those fancy stations. Hmm. Yeah, it might actually. But you know what? I'm going to use this for the moment. And now we need to get a track going out that way. And how are we going to do that? We are going to build tracks. That's how. Oh, are we now? Yeah, of course we are. So we're going to... We're going to go out in a tunnel, are we? No. Well, maybe. What if we did this? And then we did this. Yeah. Yeah, we could do that. And if we bend it that way. Yep. Do that. Then we can bend it around this way. Yeah. Okay. And then we do that. Okay. Well, that's definitely a couple of tracks. So we're going to do this. Yeah. And this. Yep. Okay, now what are you going to do? Well, I suppose build more tracks. Oh. Right. You're going to build more tracks. And... Yeah. Okay. Now, if we come around like this. Yeah, I think that might be okay. Do you? Yeah, I, I kind of do. Now, uh, we need to get... Oh, hey. It might make more sense to approach it in around this way. It might. No, it doesn't. No, we really need to come in along this side of the river. Okay. Well, in that case, you need to get down off this um, this uh, hill. Yeah, we kind of do. You mean kind of like this? You know, that might actually do it. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure it does do it. Yeah, what's giving you that notion? Well, you know, the fact that it did. Oh, I see. It's one of those, is it? Yeah, it's one of those. Okay, so we're going to... We're going to run along the ridge here, are we? Yeah. Just because it seems like the place to go. Uh, so where are you? how are you going to get past Trantor there? You ask a good question. I could go around over here. You could. And you've got that freight operation up there with the uh, plastics factories. Yeah, yeah, I do. Or you could go under that uh, bridge over there by the river. Yeah, yeah, I could do that. Um, yeah. Which side of the track are we on? that side okay now I could easily get through here yeah 
and I can easily get through here. You know what? We're going to go for around back of Trantor there. Uh, we are, are we? Yeah, because we can actually do that easily. Aha, yes, I see. We definitely can. Okay, and then we'll go in back of New New York as well, right? Yeah, exactly. We'll go in back of New New York. Okay, well, we can definitely do that. Then we need to do what? Well, then we're going to need to get across the river. Oh, yes, yes. We're definitely going to need to do that. So, why are you going away from the river there? Well, because I can. Uh, yeah, that's going to be really low. I don't think I want it quite that low. What if we do this? Um, that's maybe higher than we need to go. What if we do this? Yeah, it's not quite as ridiculous. And we're going to go across there. Yeah. Now, we need to come in and start uh, doing the, uh, the food things. Yeah. Yeah, doing the food things. That's what we're going to do. Right, yes. Uh, you know what? Yeah, that would be fine, coming up like that. Okay. You know, you're going to need to put the other um, track in now. Yeah, I kind of am. Ammond I. Ammond? Since when is that a word? Well, since I said it, I suppose. No, I'm pretty, pretty sure other people have used it as well. But Ammond? Really? Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, it's not not it, it just isn't the sort of thing I would normally say now, is it? No, no it isn't. So why did you say it? Oh, just because I suppose. That's uh why you say anything, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I suppose it is. You know, you could talk about something more um engaging or something. Yeah, yeah, I could. Uh this uh two voice thing. You've ripped it off from the kernel failure, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, I probably have. Oh, you're going to be honest about that. Well, yeah, why not? You know, you have a point there. Now, what are you going to do? Well, I need to get a track over toward, uh, say, this here um, uh, farm. Oh, so you're going to put a uh, you're going to put a a thing here. You know, a thing is otherwise known as a station. Oh, is that what it is? Oh, stop being an idiot. Yeah, I suppose I should. Yeah, so we need to get um, get a uh, station in here, right? Which we can do easily enough here. Right. So if we do... No, no. You need to build the other track before you do that. Yeah, it's going to make it a lot easier to put in that... Uh, that slipped crossover thing, isn't it? Yeah, that's exactly why you need to build that first. Ah. Then you can do this. Yeah, I really can. Good. Okay. So, that is a, that's a line. Yeah, yeah it is. So, how are you going to get a train on it? Well, I rather suspect I'm going to build a depot. Oh, you're going to build a depot. Yeah. Where? Where? Well, I'm thinking, you know, no, don't do that. Just build a depot. Oh, yeah. Well, I need, 
well, you could put it over here on this flat area. Yeah, sure, that area is flat. No. Okay, as long as you're 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 not sure. Uh you're gonna put it over here. Yeah, I'm gonna put it over here. Um why are you doing it that way? Because I can. Oh. Well, I suppose that's a good reason. And you're doing it so it can launch trains in both directions, aren't you? Yep. That's exactly what I'm doing. Good. Now you need to build the depot. Yeah. Just give me a moment. You could have turned that in the other direction. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely could have. Now what are we going to do? We're going to buy a train. Oh, we are. The Baldwin, Baldwin, I think, is... Uh, yeah, the Baldwin. So we'll add a Baldwin. And we're going to go for a cargo. And this is going to be gondolas, I believe. Yeah. Yep. It's going to be gondolas. That carries seven. Yeah, okay. You're putting 16 cars on there. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm going to have 112 capacity. That's why. And we can afford, you know, four and a bit million for a train. Yeah, I suppose we can. So that's going to be a new line. And it's going to go here to here yeah yep you know you should put some uh signals on there yeah that would probably be smart wouldn't it yeah it probably would especially over here and a few Really, uh, do that, do that. So you do realize that you've built this new line that's totally separate to your uh, existing rail network. Yeah, uh, I definitely did that. Uh, do you have any reasoning why? Well, it occurred to me that it was uh, a situation where uh, the existing network didn't actually have a reasonably direct connection. So, as a result, it made more sense to build a new line. Ah, so you did think about it. Yeah. Yeah, I did. You thought about it for about 10 seconds, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, that's about right. Okay, so you've uh, built this new line. Have you put any thought into how you're going to connect it to the rest of the network? Not especially. I was thinking I would uh, put a track that connects it when it makes sense to do so. Well, I suppose that does make some level of sense when you uh, think about it. That's kind of what I was thinking. This is a long track. Yeah, it really is a long track. Uh, put one of those there. Uh, okay. So, uh, what we're going to do also, before we do anything else, we're going to... That's Winchesterton Fieldville Farm number 7. Farm number 7. Yeah, okay, good. Now, line 1... What are we calling things? Um, right. CT and then... Yeah. 
So that's going to be CT Winchester Ton Fieldville Farm Number Seven Collector. I need to abbreviate Winchesterton Fieldville. WCFV. Yeah. Okay. Right. Now, if we go down over here and we. No. Go in here. And. Oh, for pity's sake. Okay, and we grab this. Yep. Then we can jump on board here and we can ride it. We're heading to the food exchange first because that makes sense. <laughs> right. Okay. Now let's see what this looks like. It should look very much like the, uh, the uh, rest of the uh, uh, operation on this map, you know, with the hills in the distance and the hills in the foreground and the flats and the towns and all that jazz. But we've got this nice swooping curving track here. I kind of like it. Oh look, it was autosave. Right. You know, it looks like this came came together reasonably well. Where does uh, does this? Uh, oh yeah, we got to go up over the the pass there, the ridge. Yep, here we go. We're coming around. We're going to come up on the on the food exchange reasonably quick. Okay, we have a bit of a slowdown on the uphill there, but not too bad. And would you look at that, a big station. Okay. You know, I kind of even like the uh, rock face there, the, the cliff around the station. You know, it kind of works. Yeah. Okay, so now uh, we'll go all the way to the farm. And we'll see what that looks like. I have it running in the on the fast speed mode here, so that's why things are moving quickly, even though we're uh, running at 50k. Right. So while uh, while we're uh, looking along here, uh, you know, ticking along here, uh, I'm going to be doing two episodes of Transport Fever Two. Uh, each week now. Uh, we're going to have a second one on Tuesdays for for uh, a while now uh, because I'm replacing the thing I was doing on Tuesdays with this. Yeah. Uh, and I think we've got plenty of projects that we can do on this map. So I figured, yeah, let's, um, let's just... Uh, uh, run uh, run some more episodes of it and uh, get through it a little faster. Yeah. Uh, you know, seems like a thing to do. So do a couple of uh, couple of transport fevers weekly. Um, yeah. And since a couple of you watch these, uh, it uh, seems like it might be worth doing. Right. And uh, quite frankly, this thing is uh, far more interesting than the uh, the thing that's being replaced. Yeah.
Okay, so we're on the part of the track that we didn't see going the other way now. Okay, so we should there, there's our uh, our bridge. Actually, I should be able to flatten some of that track out. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Okay, so we'll uh, trundle across the bridge here. Yeah, I kind of like this part of it at least. Yeah. So we're just about at the farm now. Okay, now we're into the farming area, and here's the farm. Okay, and we are going to pick up a rather large collection of grain. Uh, looks like we're taking a full load of grain. Yep, and I think we can run a second train on that line. So, nope. Nope. Uh, where is it? Here. Manage vehicles. Duplicate. Yeah. I think we can run two on that line easily enough. Uh, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to run two trains. Okay, so the next uh, next bit is we'll uh, get this uh, farm connected in and uh, probably... Hmm. And then work out how to bring these these farms into that area as well. And then the rest of this, uh, we'll probably use the existing rail network and we'll make a crossover point maybe over here at the close point. Yeah, that might be a good, a good spot for a crossover point. Uh, yeah, this episode, however, is long enough. So... Uh, yeah, we're definitely going to uh, put a cut here. And then uh, from from there, uh, we'll, uh, we'll work in here and then we'll figure out the rest of them. Okay, so uh, that's going to be all for this time. So stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. I mean, there might be some sort of light at the end of a tunnel. It might even be something other than an oncoming train. Yeah, it might be. Uh, and I guess uh, you can like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell. Or I guess, if, of course, you could dislike too. Uh, apparently it all helps something somewhere. Uh, you might get notified of videos or something. Yeah, uh, I know it's a novel idea. And then I guess see you back next time.